Have you ever wondered what happens after a star explodes? What could possibly survive such a cataclysmic event? Well, let's delve into the cosmic ballet of a supernova. Imagine a star, much like our own sun, but far older. Over the course of its life, it has fused hydrogen into helium, helium into carbon, and so on, up until iron. But iron is the end of the line. The star can't extract any more energy from fusion, so the core collapses under its own weight, triggering an explosion of astronomical proportions. This, my friends, is a supernova. Now, you might think that's the end of the story, but here's where it gets truly fascinating. From the wreckage of the stellar detonation, a neutron star is born. These celestial bodies are incredibly dense, packing more mass than our sun into a sphere about the size of a city. Imagine, if you will, over one and a half times the mass of the sun squeezed into a sphere just 20 kilometers across. That's like cramming Mount Everest into a thimble. Making this spectacle even more awe-inspiring is the James Webb Space Telescope, humanity's eye in the sky. This technological marvel has been instrumental in observing and studying these cosmic phenomena. From its vantage point a million miles from Earth, it peers into the remnants of supernova and captures the birth of neutron stars. Recently, it has been observing a supernova known as SN 1987A, a cataclysmic event that happened 160,000 light years away and gave birth to a neutron star. The data gathered by this telescope is helping us understand the life cycle of stars and the extreme physics that governs the universe. These observations are not just beautiful, they're crucial in answering some of the biggest questions about our cosmos. So, after a star explodes, we have the birth of a neutron star, an incredibly dense object that continues to fascinate scientists. And with tools like the James Webb Space Telescope, we're likely to keep making exciting discoveries about these stellar remnants for years to come. Imagine witnessing a star's explosive end and the birth of a neutron star. That's exactly what happened with the supernova known as SN 1987A. This celestial event is no ordinary occurrence. It's the first visible supernova since the year 1604, a cosmic spectacle that remained elusive for over three centuries. Sen 1987A erupted in a blaze of glory a massive star explosion occurring a staggering 160,000 light years away from Earth. Yet, despite this unimaginable distance, the event was observed right here on our home planet in February of 1987. Talk about a delayed telecast, but what's truly captivating is the nature of SN 1987A. It was identified as a core collapse supernova a type of stellar explosion that results from the gravitational collapse of a massive star's core. This collapse triggers an explosion so powerful it outshines an entire galaxy, marking the end of the star's life in a grand fiery finale. But death in the cosmic sense often brings about new life, and that's where the James Webb Space Telescope comes into play. In July 2022, it captured images and spectra of SN 1987A. The data revealed ionized argon signatures indicative of high-energy radiation, typically associated with, you guessed it, a neutron star. Neutron stars, these incredibly dense remnants of massive star explosions, exhibit densities several times that of the Sun. And right there, midst the remnants of SN 1987A, a newborn neutron star was observed, marking a new chapter in this celestial saga. With SN 1987A, we've been given a front row seat to witness the life cycle of a star and the birth of a neutron star. But why does this matter? What's the significance of witnessing the birth of a neutron star? You may ask. Well, the unveiling of a neutron star's inception is more than just a fascinating spectacle. It confirms and enriches our understanding of the life cycle of stars and the mechanisms that govern our universe. Neutron stars, these incredibly dense celestial objects, are born from the explosive death of massive stars, a phenomenon we know as supernovas. 
witnessing the birth of a neutron star from the remnants of supernova SN 1987A provides direct evidence supporting this theory. It's like capturing a butterfly emerging from its chrysalis, but on a cosmic scale. The observation of ionized argon signatures indicative of high-energy radiation further cements the presence of a neutron star. Such discoveries are not just about validating our existing theories, they also open up new avenues of exploration. The birth of a neutron star from supernova SN 1987A has been observed thanks to the James Webb Space Telescope. With this state-of-the-art technology, we can delve deeper into the cosmos, probing the mysteries of neutron stars and other celestial bodies. Looking ahead, there are plans to continue studying SN 1987A and its associated neutron star. Each observation, each data point collected, contributes to our collective knowledge and understanding of the universe. The more we discover, the more we realize how much there is yet to uncover. With each new discovery, we piece together a little more of the cosmic puzzle, inching closer to understanding the mysteries of our universe.